We are recording. I am attempting a session tonight to reach Queen Elizabeth II. I have been asked many times since her death now to ask for her. I do not know if we will be able to reach her, but that is the case with any time, any time I reach out to anyone. So I will trust in the process. I've grounded and I've prepared and I've just got a few questions. I'm not going to um, ask for her for too long. And it is her voice reversed, slowed, and chopped into small increments and randomly placed back together. So we have a full track, three, four minutes of gibberish of just the sound of her voice. Okay, there are no words for no false positives. And it is a method that works very well. I will begin here. I will now turn on this app and we will warm up. I'm going to focus and I'm going to bring myself to the astral room. I set foot into the astral room as I as I do. I will just raise the lights within the room. Oh, yeah. And I will set out a chair in preparation. Oh, set out a chair in preparation for the queen. And I am now inviting Queen Elizabeth II I will actually use her name. I will put her information, her name into a flower. I feel a lot of energy and I see like the room starting to change a little bit. It's almost like there's a gold trim uh, forming around it. And I see the door opening. And it does feel like there are multiple like angels or um, it, it feels like they're, they're angelic help out of angels or there's a few of them coming in. It feels like they're with her. And I'm looking to connect with you, Queen Elizabeth II. I am looking to connect with you, inviting your spirit in, inviting your soul in, your energy. If you would grace us with your presence. My name is Josh. I am a medium, an afterlife researcher, a spirit communicator. But I don't see you yet. It feels like I see her coming in, but it seems like a very bright light. It's, it's a bright light. It's weird. It's very amazing. But I sense a woman behind that light. I, I welcome you and I invite you to sit in this chair that placed in the room for you. I have your voice. I'm going to give you your voice to use and um, 
Let me switch over to your voice. This is one single voice that's using this. So this this would be a spirit. This would be a spirit using this right now, I feel like. I hear you, whoever this is. I thank you for helping. I ask the guides to help. I see that there are like, I, you know, I don't know if they're angels or what, but they're like in the corners of the room as she is there. <laughs> which is, I think, a very interesting thing. I've never seen that before. Um, grateful to connect with you. I won't keep you long, but it is an honor. And there are many that will be anxious to hear from you. Um, you have the ability to help still in the afterlife, even just with this, because you have the ability to share um, some of your experience and maybe answer a few questions so let me switch this off. Queen Elizabeth II, an amazing woman. Many, so many loved you. I see this bright light with you. How are you? You seem very bright. You seem like you are in good spirit. It seems like there are many with you or some with you. Can you confirm that? How, how wild is this for you? How um, amazing is this. You're having transitioned into the other side. You lived a full life. And here is this, you know, afterlife researcher, communicator using a device to work with you. Um, what, what do you think of this? Someone is asking, um, someone is a great supporter of yours, one of many, 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 wants to know, um, are, you, are you at peace? Are you at peace now? It seems like you are. Some questions I'd like to ask you, but I would like to get your, um, if there's anything that you would like to say on your own to people that will see this, what's something you want to say on your own? Your Majesty, I know that you're on the other side and you're no longer the Queen, but to everyone, um, so many, you will still be the queen for many, many years to come. Um, someone that they loved and they appreciated and uh, they had honor. Um, they took honor in the royal family. Can I ask you, what was the reception like on the other side? When you got there, clearly it was peaceful, it was beautiful, there was light because I see that you have light. Um, what was the reception like for you when you got there? Something everybody come. It sounded like it was just beautiful. It was really amazing. It's kind of undeniable to say that once you passed and the announcement was made, there was this beautiful rainbow that formed over the palace, over Buckingham Palace. And I saw pictures of it. It was just, uh, just astounding. And people could say it's just, you know, it rained or it was a coincidence, but I don't believe that's a coincidence. 
Was that rainbow you? Or was that someone else, the divine, helping or showing a sign? Did you have anything to do with that rainbow? Something share. I won't keep you for too much longer, and if I hear anything that I that I hear your response as well, and you share that you would like to speak again, maybe um, I will ask for you, but I'm very respectful. And like I said, it's an honor. Um, have you reunited with Prince Philip yet? Have you reunited with Prince Philip? Yes, or something correct. I don't know. I'll have to go back and listen. But I'm, I'm listening now. You seem like there's already people with you. It seems like you're filled with light. Um, or you have light. And, you know, it's just really remarkable. Is that true? Again, anything you want to say about that? now um, let you go and I just want to thank you um, it's always an honor and I never expect anyone to just come through but I I do take a lot of pride and grateful for the work that I get to do uh, Queen Elizabeth II is there anything else that you want to say It's an honor and I'm sending you love and I hope that you continue to get to do what you want to do on the other side and help people. I really believe that's what it's all about. So thank you, um, Your Majesty. saved you and uh, thank you thank you your majesty okay. I feel like a guy just nodded at me like yeah to my left thank you I trust that this worked for her second night of sessions for Queen Elizabeth II. I have said my prayers, I have done my meditation, and I am uh, excited to ask for her for Queen Elizabeth II again. She really came through, I feel. I'm inviting the Queen, Her Majesty, to grace us with her presence yet again. She's funny. She had messages of love and confirmed a lot. I will focus and warm up. Queen Elizabeth 
the second, your majesty, beautiful soul, I invite you. see her at the door with again a number of people it feels like it feels like there's more than I don't know there's like four or five there I'm gonna shut off this app and go to her voice I'm going to trust that we are um, ready to go Your funeral uh, procession is, is, I think, complete and guards are around you, it's tradition. Um, were you able to see all of the, um, the ceremonies, all of the, uh, the recognition, the remembrance, all of the love that was shown to you? Were you able to feel that and see that? I just want to thank you right now for for coming through and for allowing us to communicate and for people to hear from you. Um, I just want to thank you. I know they will thank you as well. You said Oh yes, oh goodness yes, that you have met up with Philip. How has that reunion been? How has that been for you to connect with him? Is he happy to see you? Is he happy? Are you both happy? These wonderful people with you that I see, I feel. Are you going to be around the palace? Are you going to be around your family? Um, around uh, your son who is now king? Are you going to be around or are you going to be kind of you know, let me just ask you, are you going to be around um, them in the palace? Is there any final message that you'd like to give right now, um, Queen Elizabeth II? 